And these bears are huge. They are large scale, and this is one of the installations that you'll see at Chinook Center over the holiday season. I'm being joined this morning by Sander, who's the sculptor manager here at Heavy Industries. Uh, this is a really cool project. You guys installed these last year. They're here for a facelift and ready for the next Christmas season where there will be lots of traffic to see them. So let's talk a little bit about what materials you guys use to construct something like this. How, how are these made? Well, um, once uh, the concept is uh, figured out, uh, we make 3D model. Okay. And uh, once the 3D model is finished, it's approved by engineer, and then the um, the model is sent down to milling, and it's actually milled in uh, EPS foam, which is basically styrofoam. Okay. And then there's metal inserted in it, and once that's all done, it's taken into the coatings area, and it's co covered with a polyurea coating, which is a very durable coating. That's actually when you touch it, that's what you feel. Okay. Is the polyurea, yeah. and then it's painted, mm -hmm. and um, it's basically ready for install. Okay, so it's the metal obviously that makes this heavy, not mm -hmm. the foam. Should there not be metal in this, I could basically lift it over my head. Yes, I, I would say this would be about 30 pounds, maybe 20 pounds, with uh, without the metal in it. Okay, how heavy is it with the metal? Uh, probably about 100 pounds, maybe 150 pounds even. Okay, that's yeah. the baby bear. Yeah. How about the mama bears? Uh, the mama bear, this one is about 500 pounds, and the, the large one over there is about 1,200 pounds. 1,200 pounds, yeah. and that one will reach two stories, so yes. it's 25 feet. 25 feet. Yeah. Uh, really large scale, obviously, and transporting these guys is quite an interesting project, too. So you have to disassemble these to bring them into the mall. Yes, um, so. So we, from here, we'll uh, see some of the legs are sitting over there. We take the the bears, the, the big bodies, and we put them on a flat trailer. We crane it on the flatbed trailer, bring it over to the shop, crane it off the uh, flatbed trailer, and uh, we fit them. They just barely fit through the doors. Yeah. And once they're through the doors, we bring all the other pieces and we assemble them and then lift them in the place um, once they uh, are inside the mall. Wow, pretty interesting stuff. Obviously a lot of traffic at Chinook Center over the holiday season. I would imagine that there would be kids climbing all over these things. But actually really no damage to the bears from last year. Uh, no, uh, you, you might think that they might climb on this, but in general they seem to they seem to keep away. They, they just kind of hopefully just look at it and enjoy it. <laughs> okay, well they are pretty neat to see and you can see them at Chinook Center made right here locally at Heavy Industries. We're going to talk about another project plus the travel Light the various incarnations. We're going to show those to you in the eight o'clock hour, guys. Very cool. Thanks, Joe. I think they're talking about kids. I'd be all over that if I was like four years old.